Claudia, how's it going down there? Yeah, you guys, like you said, we are not thrown in the beach towel just yet. It is still summer, so we're going to act like it's still summer. And you know what? The best thing to do is to get ice cream. So we came to one of the most iconic ice cream places, not only in Michigan, but in the country. We are at the parlor of Jackson, and we're celebrating summer. And I'm here with Andrea, who's going to help us do that. But first, we're going to rewind a little bit, because to get that you know, title of being such an iconic yes. summer place, you have to work for it, you have to get Correct. it, and you guys have been doing that for decades. So yes. rewind and tell us a little bit of that history in the parlor. Uh, the building itself of the parlor has been here since like 1915, so it definitely goes back many years. Um, it started where they were making milk and delivering it. Um, we were making our own ice cream at one point. It's been through a couple different name changes, and it came to the iconic parlor of Jackson, um, where we grew to be the number one Michigan Number one, Michigan's number one parlor, I mean ice cream parlor, and it's nice to be a part of that because it is something big. It's almost like a tourist attraction. Yeah, it is really cool. Yes. And now, I was, you know, doing my research a little bit earlier, and I, I came here as a kid, and I remember when I was doing my research, I was looking at pictures, and I couldn't tell from the pictures whether it was taken, you know, in the yes. 60s or today. What is it, how do you guys get it to not change throughout those decades? Try to keep it the same, maintain it. We want people to have that feeling when they were a kid, when they come back. And you know, you get all the back in my day stories, yeah. you know, <laughs> and you love it because they're like, but it still looks the same. So it makes them feel like they're a kid again almost. So we just keep up clean every day, yeah. do the maintenance that we do and just try to keep it how they like it. Yeah, and yeah. you guys have managed to keep it looking like that iconic parlor look, yes. which is so, so cool. Um, you know, what are some things that you've noticed that maybe have changed over the years um, that you kind of like? Um, bringing the picnic tables that are coming outside is nice. It brings, it draws attraction. People like to go outside and sit. It's part of it. And then bringing the community and you're actually having a, a social community with the ice cream and it's bringing everybody a part of it and I always like that to be part of the community. Absolutely and so one of the cool things about this place is you can talk to you know a grandpa who came here as a kid but then you can also talk to a grandson yeah, who came yeah. here. What is it about this place that's so special that kind of bridges the generations together? I think it just is a, a warm place in everybody's heart where it has always brought them good memories, a good experience, and they just want to give that to their people, as their, their family as well, and show them what they got from it as well. And just nice, warm family gathering, have a nice ice cream. Yeah. Who doesn't like ice cream? You know? I, it would be, I would be hard pressed to find someone who doesn't actually like ice right. cream. Right, right, <laughs> yeah. yes. <laughs> and so, you know, I think when, when you come here, it's not just about coming here and the experience, it's also about people who work here too. Yes, yeah, um, so yeah. what has it been like to be in this experience of serving generations? It's nice, it's nice to see it. It's the smiles and you can almost have four or five generations at one table sitting together to have that same experience that they've literally went through their whole lives having together and they brung the, the little one for their first time. You know what I'm saying? So it's, it's nice, I like it. Um, I love being, fr I love the friendly atmosphere, the good vibes, you know what I'm saying? It's always, it's nothing like real hectic here. Everybody's real laid back and they just eat some ice cream and we'll be good. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> well, you know, we talked about the history, but we are not done with the conversation yet. We still have to talk about, you know, the, the I would say the uh, guest of honor of the ice cream. Yes. So <laughs> stick around. We're going to talk about the ice cream next and kind of what the staple is that makes it so iconic. So we'll head back to the station for now. But um, stick around.